I see a lot of businesses needing to get new customers at the moment and I totally get it. I see you trying to make sure you navigate the tricky waters of how to phrase things and what to do. And I want to give you a tool right now to help you move forward through this, to help you not annoy people add value, and how to add value and build trust with people at the moment. I call it the trust bridge. And what it means is instead of selling something that people will buy from you, find something that you can give them for free that builds a trust bridge, builds trust between you and them. One of the pieces of advice I've been giving some of my retailers who are essential suppliers is not to use a lot of advertising, not to use a lot of information on their social channels where they have people who might come in and attack them because it's been pretty volatile to be honest for some of them. But they're using their email lists carefully because that's a place where they've already built trust. They can sell direct to those people and those people are happily able to set to be booked to sold to and to buy from them because they've got a trust bridge in place. So during this time of change and evolving and working out what you do, instead of slapping on a sales post about what you can do or even just asking someone to book a time in with you, which also actually encourages an element of trust needed to do that, find a way to add value to those people first by giving them something that builds trust with them with a very low entry point. So that makes them feel safe to find out a bit more about you, your values and what you do without having to worry that they're going to be sucked into some sort of sales cycle or have to commit too early. A trust bridge does exactly what it says. It builds trust and trust is the most important marketing tool you have in your arsenal right now. So I really recommend build that trust bridge. It takes a bit longer, but the payoff long term is well worth it.